Hello guys, we will be talking about uh, iPhone uh, Face ID problem uh, which you might have on X11, um, XS, XS Pro. So we have got iPhone 11 here today uh, which I would like to show you what if the problem is not in the component where you can find lots of um, videos uh, like front camera module. Uh, I will show you here what I'm talking about. So this is front camera module. So most of the time the problem is here where you have to replace this dot projector. So we have already tested this uh, dot projector but there's nothing wrong with it. So nothing wrong with it, which you can check on um, JC Pro or there are other equipment which are available. So there's nothing wrong with it. The problem is here in this cable, which is um, which consists of um, front speaker, ambient light sensor. This is ambient light sensor here. This one, where is my user? This is ambient light sensor and the other component on this is this one here which is flood eliminator. What if the problem is in this cable? So but there is uh, nothing available at the moment which uh, any equipment which you can test this. So the only way to check is uh, which I have done, um, I will show you. So I'm just looking at the cable. Let's look here. So put it aside. So, okay. So I will take you under the microscope. Is it working? Not working. Oh, yeah. Light. Okay. So the first thing, unfortunately, to sort out where the problem is, I will take this one here. See, first of all, you have to, generally, most of the time I have seen the problem is with ambient light sensor, but that might be flood illuminator. So in this case, I have, see, already removed this um, ambient light sensor, and then we have after removing this, we have tested and the um, face ID was working fine. And the next thing I have to do is, uh, see this is the ambient light sensor here, which I have removed. Oh, again here, microscope. So, David, yes. is this the one which is faulty one or no? This is good. Good one. Okay. Can you give me the faulty one? So this is the one which I have removed and uh, yep, this is the faulty one. This is the faulty one which I have removed and after removing this we have checked and the face ID was working fine. This was causing the problem. Maybe this was creating a short on the, you know, the cable and then somehow um, the flood el eliminator was not working because it's on the same cable. So now what I have to do now is to remove from another which I have already done and then solder it back onto uh, the one which we have taken out from the phone. First of all we will tint this part. So I have, um, while removing there was some metal ground was exposed which I have already masked it with um, UV glue. Okay, once this is done now we will get um, 
um, the ambient light sensor new one so this is the new ambient light sensor I think I will get another user but because this one has got some glue on it and um, let's just keep sticking I'll just move my microscope so that you can see clearly here is okay all right this looks okay to me we'll just because underneath is flux and it's just slippery making it as making slippery surface and just keep moving anyway it's a little bit too but should be okay and we will put some flux here as well yep Okay, let's do just one by one. Yep. And here. Okay, looks okay to me. We will clean it and then test it. okay give it a little bit of clean yeah looks okay now we will install it this will go on the top here and can you see no, no, the other way here and here right and uh, get the LCD So if you got a phone with Face ID is not working, it's important you should have um, any equipment to check um, dot projector. If it's not the dot projector and if it's showing it's working fine, then um, the problem could be here in this cable. So let's put this cable first, which is hello. Check 
Or was the metro? Yeah. Good. Oh, was the metro? If you'll say yes. Tell me, here at the time where I was so after the Philippine Hill 5, because I met somebody else before. Come on, man. Okay. Just turn it down. So let's see how it goes. If this is faulty, or it's also flood emanator. So it turned on and we have got a message here. That message is what? Saying Face ID and Apple Pay are ready to be set up. So that means it's working now. So Face ID and Apple Pay are ready to set up now. So let's put the password. Close. Okay, so no message. What it says, finish setting up iPhone. Face ID and Apple Pay are ready to be set up. Okay, and not now because customer will do it. So, thank you guys. So, just letting you know if Face ID is not working, it's always not um, the dot projector. It could be the front cable which consists of your um, speaker and ambient light sensor and flood emanator. Also check that as well. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.